Hey up, Chuggernauts, how are we doing? And welcome back to another episode of Said Says. We are back today with our second music video reaction of the day in which we're going to be checking out brand new music from the band A Killer's Confession. Now, if you've never heard of that band before, do not worry, because I am pretty sure you will have heard of a little band called Mushroom Head. Now, Waylon Revis, who is the frontman of A Killer's Confession, obviously was once one of the frontmen in Mushroom Head, in my particular, yeah, my particular favourite incarnation of Mushroom Head. Um, Save Your Sorrow is my all-time favourite album by those guys, and I really, really enjoyed Beautiful Stories for Ugly Children and The Righteous and The Butterfly as well. I mean, I love the earlier Mushroom Head stuff. The new album, which was called... Um, a Wonderful Life, meh, it was alright, but those three particular albums that I mentioned there are absolutely all solid albums that I play on the regular. And in about 2018, I first checked out uh, A Killer's Confession after I found out that Waylon was doing this project. He'd been doing it since 2016, so I was pretty late to the party, but what I heard was absolutely amazing. Their 2019 album that was called The Indifference of Good Men is so fucking good. It's got some great singles on there, such as uh, Numb, uh, Angel on the Outside, Cocaine, The Shore, just to name a couple. And if you've not heard that yet, I seriously suggest checking it out after this reaction video. But today we're going to be checking the brand new single from these guys that dropped, let's have a look, January 27th, so it's only been out a day. Um, and the reviews that I've seen online for it so far are really, really good. All very glowing reviews, so I'm sure I'm going to dig it. I mean, this band kind of described themselves as alternative metal that throw in kind of elements of industrial metal and new metal here and there. So if that sounds up your street, then I can guarantee you that you're going to enjoy this reaction video today. So let's jump straight on in there and check this one out. This is A Killer's Confession with their latest single, Remember. Enjoy, guys. They say the blood is thicker than water. I love that kind of like bluesy southern rock kind of guitar hook. That sounds wicked to the headphones. Such a tasty riff, that. Absolute bass tone for days. Got such a fucking chunky and fuzzy sound. Love that. I think the thing I love most about this project is obviously you can still hear Mushroom Head's influence in uh, Wayland's vocals that he does on the A Killer's Confession stuff. But. His vocal style, or what we hear in this video, shows just how far he's kind of progressed and evolved as a metal vocalist over the past kind of five, six years. Such a dynamic and powerful metal vocalist. I know I keep raving about that bass tone, but it sounds absolutely gorgeous, man. Love this, building it up. I love how groovy the music is. It's got that proper, and I'm going to use the term kind of like American rock kind of vibe to it. Like bands like um, Disturbed, Breaking Benjamin, Seven Dust, Love and Death, stuff like that. Do you feel nothing? 
so fucking good. I hope that you remember. I hope that you remember. I mean, it's catchy, it's punchy, it's riff heavy. What more do you want from an alternative metal track? It ticks all the boxes for me there. Oh, that was so fucking good. That was A Killer's Confession with their latest single, Remember. And like I said, if you did enjoy that, go back now and check out their last album that was called The Indifference of Good Men. Because there is, let's have a look, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12 wicked tracks on that album that you need to go and check out. Yeah, I love these guys. I really, really do. I'm looking forward to hearing new music from them, especially if any if that track we just listened to there is anything to go by, then I'm expecting huge, huge things from this new album. They're a band that I would love to see live. I've seen live footage on YouTube and they put on like one hell of a live show with these kind of like projectors and a really cool live um, lighting show. Um, they were meant to come to the UK a couple of years ago, um, and um, I was chatting to these guys at the time. Uh, basically, the the long story short, the promoter who was trying to book the tour for them was a bit of a con artist, um, and unfortunately the tour fell through. But I'm keeping my fingers crossed that one day we can get these guys over to the UK, because one, they'd go down so well over here, and two... That live show, judging just based off of their footage that's on YouTube, is one hell of a show to behold. Yeah, just a really, really fucking awesome band with absolutely huge tunes in their back catalogue. If you did enjoy A Killer's Confession, I will link all of their social media down below so you can go and check them out for yourselves. And if you did enjoy this episode of Said Says, please do go and hit that subscribe button to keep up to date with everything Said Says related. Oh, before we finish, actually, one more note about A Killer's Confession. They are actually due to go on tour later this year in America with Combi Christ, King A10, and Heartsick. It is an absolutely phenomenal lineup. So if you enjoyed today's reaction video and you're over in the States, make sure you go and pick up a ticket for those gigs. Um, anyway, that'll do it for this episode of Said Says. We will be back tomorrow with more music video reactions for you guys. So in the meantime, have a good evening, stay safe, and keep on chugging. <laughs>